but I was in the middle of watching Sean Garrett's Army Money podcast, and my appointment was literally it's, it was right at the place where I stopped, where he was talking about he was started crying, talking about how important it is being having prestige uh, on the world stage, speaking on like the true blacks, native blacks. Cause he was born and raised in well, he was born in Atlanta, raised in Germany, so he understands. Okay. So it was an interesting part where I stopped because it made me think of the performance I did in the Basque Country at the elementary school because I was on my teaching tour um, around the time this elementary school was doing their lesson, um, learning about different places around the world, the main countries. So I was able to visit the school when they were talking about America. So I gave the kids my coins. I, I made a blog about it and shared the video when I was freestyling for them. I did the choreo, the beginning was choreo, then I went into freestyle and then I just interacted with the children. But before I did that for them, actually I spoke. I didn't, we didn't have that recorded. But they like asked me questions in my translator, translated it and I answered it. She translated the answer. So that's when I gave the kids like all my coins. I had coins from America. I didn't have any bills. And the children, the girls had performed for me and they danced to Beyonce, uh, who run the world. And it's funny because when I was writing for the industry voice online.com, uh, I did a blog article about the controversy surrounding that video shoot. And I did a anonymous interview with my girl Izama, who I shared on, I shared uh, on her, Izama doing her pole dancing on my Twitter blog, or X. But anyway, Izama gave me the rundown of everything that happened on set, like what was going on. and. I remember that was just, it blew my mind how unprofessional Frank Gatson was and how Beyonce approved that behavior and just like how ignorant um, that whole team, that camp was and how reckless and irresponsible. So fast forward, I'm on my tour, I'm in the classroom at the school in the mountains. The school in the mountains, it's where the original Basque people live. So they got their independence from Spain. And so they have their traditional bass people that you have to go through tolls to get to their homes and their schools. So they have their own police, their own money, I believe, um, in, that, in that portion of the country. So I was in that portion of the country at this elementary school. So the, but the girls knew this Beyonce song that had all this controversy behind it. That was really not a good project. Um, but they performed for me. They had their choreography and stuff. And it was real cute. And so then I performed for them. The choreography that I taught on my tour to Azalea Banks, which is like giving them the opposite, kind of the better version of a, a pop R&B girl from the States. But, what Sean Garrett was talking about made me think about the moment I had teaching and just exchanging with those children in that very rural, sovereign, very rich with history um, part of Spain, Northwest Spain, and the impact it made to where I was officially um, documented as a cultural ambassador. I even extended my visa while I was there. Uh,